Guess what we're talking about today? Yes, we're talking about studio mics, particularly from Bayer Dynamic. Brand new microphones, they came out today. We have the M90 Pro X and the M70 Pro X. I'm gonna be toggling between these two microphones throughout this entire video as I tell you about why I like them in general. And that's gonna serve as an overall audio test between the two for you. And what I can say is I'm not gonna be doing any post-processing. This is gonna be raw directly out of the microphone, recording into my Zoom H5. All that I'm gonna be doing is normalizing the audio levels, but no processing besides that. I'll also throughout this video just give a general noise test with no audio coming whatsoever. Just generally see how loud the noise is. I've had these for a couple of months and I can tell you that the noise is almost non-existent and the audio quality is overall exceptional. And like I said, I've had these for a few months and I've been wanting to share them with you guys the whole time. The problem is that they weren't out yet. Well, they're out today, so you're gonna see these in my videos a lot more. All I've been able to do is take some photos of them for Bayer Dynamic. That was the original reason why they reached out in the first place. But after I wrapped the photos up, I couldn't help myself. I threw these mics on, tested them out, ran a bunch of test footage, and I absolutely loved them. Reached out to Bayer Dynamic and said, hey, I'm gonna drop a YouTube video on these. Is that okay with you guys? They said, no problem. Just make sure it doesn't go out before the launch date. And also I wasn't able to show any of you any of these microphones throughout my videos, obviously until they had launched. And a huge thank you to Bayer Dynamic for sending these microphones out. Hey guys, these are a home run. Thank you. I'm really appreciative that I have them and I think they're gonna do extremely well, especially in the content creation space. So in regards to what comes with the microphone, you obviously get the mic and you're also gonna get this really nice shock mount. I like how those shock mounts look a lot. The pop filter also comes with these and you can kind of see what that's doing to the plosives here. I don't think these mics have much plosives though and I think that they overall sound really good so I'm not using that pop filter as much. If I get into some voiceover work or maybe some direct podcast stuff, I might. But I like how they look without the pop filter and you can hear the plosives now. So testing some plosives on the M70 testing some plosives on the M90. So I'm obviously a fan of these and here's why I like them. I think that these are fantastic microphones for YouTube creators. I'm gonna have them in my videos a lot. They're also obviously really good for podcasting or live streams or voiceover work. I think that the M90X is their premier offering, super nice microphone. The M70X is gonna be a little bit more affordable. I actually think this is my favorite one. I like the value proposition that it offers from an audio quality perspective, as well as a price point. Another thing I like about these a lot, besides the obvious audio quality with really low noise, I like how they look. And as much as that doesn't really matter for microphones, especially when you're thinking about podcasts, I have these in frame a lot in my YouTube videos and in different podcasts that I do, we also have our microphones in frame. So the microphone needs to have a clean aesthetic in my opinion, and I'm having a really hard time finding a better looking microphone right now. These things simply look amazing. If you're curious on how to pick these microphones up, I'm putting a link down below. You can check it out. I'm not getting any commission or any affiliate links at all from Bayer Dynamic. I just genuinely believe in the product. You can check these out down below. They're out today. I'm hoping that they have a really good stock and that you can get these microphones as soon as you order them. I think they're gonna go really fast. If I was gonna be picking up one of these microphones, I'd probably be leaning toward the M70 Pro X. But again, links down below. You can check out every single specific about these microphones that you wanna see, including their pickup patterns, literally everything. But hey, that's gonna do it for me. My name is Sean DeWispelair. This channel is all about the skills behind the art of creativity, photography, videography, gear reviews, tutorials. Me being full-time in the fitness industry, it's always gonna have a little bit of a fitness feel to it. If any of that is something that you're into, subscribe down below. I'll see you in the next video. Give this video a tap on the thumbs up as well if it helped you out thinking about microphones whatsoever. And uh, if you have any questions, I'll be happy to answer them in the comments. Take care. See you.